Wandering Winder here. Bararadu. 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 Do 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 do. Is the kingdom. Um. Well, I'm gonna open stockpile on three. And I think I'm gonna go smithy here, trying to get big banishes. Gonna get another stockpile now. This is a bit annoying. Stockpile being the only plus buy is also worth watching out for. Um, gosh, this is not really what I'm looking for. So I could banish three coppers here and then get my stockpiles back. Next turn I'm going to have three again. Oh, next turn I'm going to have three again. I could get my stockpile then. So what I could do here is just banish four coppers and then next turn get my stockpiles back. It's better to just always take the stockpile, basically, for a while anyway. Do have to worry a little bit about I'm going to banish three estates. So these remaining three cards are all coppers, are they? I banished four. So now two of them are coppers, that means one of them must be another stockpile. I kind of want to take a gold here. That would leave my deck as... Yeah, it's probably better just to take the stockpile and the silver. Okay. Are you going to empty the stockpiles here? No. Take one, okay. So here, I think I am going to empty the stockpiles. And take uh, silver, I guess. Yeah. Vanishing coppers? Okay. Five fives. That's not going to be enough to end the game, I don't think. Um, trying to think. So these remaining cards are a silver, a copper, 
and three stockpiles. Do I get, did I get seven? I might have. I think I want to go like gold silver here. because I need to make sure that my deck has enough oomph after the stockpiles are gone to continue to province. Okay, you're doing something similar? Yeah, okay. Your deck is pretty decent at this point. I think I'm just going to province here. I want to keep this other stockpile around. I'm going to want to try to double at some moment, I think. For instance, this moment. That's not going to work. Um, shoot. Yeah, your deck should be very consistent now, but you... Yeah, your deck should be very consistent now. So I need to just keep provincing, I guess. I got a province here. Oh my, you did not province. Okay. Um I could try to do double seer here. To try to make my deck consistent. I don't think so though. I think I'm just gonna province. At some moment I can because you've taken this time out, I should be able to uh banish at some moment. Maybe. I should have the time to anyway. I also have this one extra point from banishing three estates as opposed to two. You probably leave those three on top of your deck. Well, I'm certainly going to deny this. Playing that advisor just cleared your deck, which didn't seem to be doing that much for you to me. Uh, I think I'm in good shape now. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and take the duchy here. I think. Yeah. Part of me wants to banish two provinces, but... I just don't think I can realistically lose if I go this way. Uh, maybe I'm supposed to deny the junk dealer there because you have the seers, but if I can just keep duchying every turn, I should be fine. I can even miss a little bit. Yeah, you province, because you need me to miss a lot of stuff. I could banish now. What are my last cards here? They are... One duchy, 18, 21, a duchy of province, a gold, a copper, and a silver. Duchy, province, gold, copper, silver. Um, I think I want to banish three provinces here. Duchy, province. Can 
gonna touchy now. I'm gonna touchy back. I frog here. This should be very good for me. I mean, there's very good chance that if I just played the smithy I was winning, but frogging I think is even more assured. Oh, and I get the province here. I was just hoping to hit, make sure I hit duchy. Um, Yeah, I think the power of Banish is very strong. Um, I think I kind of drew poorly in the beginning to make it even kind of be this close. Obviously the 5-2, I maybe not obviously, but I think the 5-2 is actually quite poor. I think I liked going for the Smithy as opposed to the Banish open, but that's worth thinking about. And I guess you could try to build something here with acting troops to try to go bigger. But I'm a bit concerned because the stockpiles run out. Although there is the little bit of a trick with the changelings here um, to be able to get your stockpiles back without lowering the stockpiles, your opponent's just going to empty the stockpiles anyway. And So I don't actually think that's a great call, although maybe tactically there could have been a spot for it. I don't know. Tell me what you think. Thanks for watching.